Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Maria and I'm the girl behind the blog, Sweet Life Housewife. Today we're going to talk about transitioning your style from summer into fall. And if you like videos about style and fashion, I encourage you to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell, and like this video. I'm going to start by showing you a typical summer outfit and then how I will transition it into fall. For summer, I have the white capri jeans. I switch out for the blue jeans, um, distressed, and you could also do non-distressed if you prefer. Um, some people have a problem with that, and blue, dark blue jeans, light blue jeans, um, everything kind of goes right now. So um, I would recommend an ankle or capri length while it's still transitioning into the colder uh, weather. It's still warm here in the south, I know, and I'm in love with my Rockstead sandals. I will, I will wear these into October. Adding a cardigan is great for that in-between weather. This Barefoot Dreams one is so soft and cozy as per usual. I'll link everything below. A quick random fun fact. I got these Valentino uh, dupes for going to the beach in case you know, something happened to them or whatever. I didn't want to ruin the real McCoy and I wasn't sure if this would be comfortable because I'm not used to wearing like these jelly kind of um, flip-flops. So I got them, I wore them all the time and I got tons of compliments on them and now I'm going to put the real ones on my Christmas list just so you know. <laughs> so here I have paired the leopard cami from the Nordstrom anniversary sale with the faux leather Spanx and Louboutin slingbacks. You could also top this with a multiple choice um, third layer. As an option, you could also wear the rock studs with this. Okay, here I've paired another basic satin cami with AG cropped ankle jeans that really show off the shoes. You can substitute any statement shoe here and then top it with a blazer for a look that is really very on trend this fall. The moto jacket is also a good option and it's still on trend as well. This blush one is from Walmart. I'll link it below. It's from the Sofia Vergara collection, and um, one of the other jeans that were distressed at the ankle were from them as well. Another easy thing to do is just use a basic sheer scarf so it's not too heavy before the weather changes, um, and you still want to add a touch of fall without you know too much a layering. I could take that jacket off and still use um, that scarf, or just wrap it around your waist adding a hat here and this hat is really cute it's gonna keep the sun out of your eyes at festivals too so these are the jeans from the Sofia Vergara collection at Walmart with a basic tee and moto the Vince Camuto booties are such a favorite I love the look of a t-shirt dress with a jean jacket it's just really casual and I think that the sneakers are really cute and comfortable uh, one thing about the crop is it can make me look a little wide, I would say. So I am going to switch it out for this pink jean jacket, which is a little bit different stylistically. And I think it has a slimming effect because of the way that it kind of elongates my torso instead of um, stopping in the middle, just like, bam. So this next look I'm going to show with three different pairs of shoes. Started off with the sneakers. Um, dark floral is big for fall. Olive is again as well. You can pair this with the mule or the booty too. I think I like the mule the best. So again in this um, outfit here you could switch out for jeans if it's cooler. We're really hot here in Atlanta. You can see that depending on what your climate is you might want to go more towards jeans. If it's colder more towards shorts. If it's still really warm. I'm in Atlanta so it does get um, pretty hot here. It's about 90 degrees today and um, it's supposed to be this way for a little while and so it might not cool down until more towards October, maybe even the end of October into November um, depending on what's happening this year. But anyway, um, the uh, Barefoot Cozy Dreams cardigan is much more um, warm and snuggly so that would be more um, for when it gets a little bit cooler into autumn and the olive one is more um, sort of open and um, lighter weight and stuff like that. So anyway, I hope that you liked today's video. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything.